Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of CK2. Uh, as the Count of Gulten, where, as you guys know, we have successfully over the next, I would say, 40 years, been trying to do different things to try to get to the tier of duchy, and have failed basically pretty miserably because there's absolutely no way. For some reason, my guy isn't wanting to fabricate claims, so we can't get a claim onto somebody, which really infuriates me. I mean, I wish we could get a claim onto, like, you know, this guy's land so that maybe we could do some stuff with it, but we just don't. And I just don't know why. It's really kind of annoying, but, um, one of the quickest ways we've been thinking about... Oh, yeah, the Ibadi Faith apparently triumphed. Um, one of the things I was thinking about doing... Ugh, Mm. Okay, that's... My voice is kind of weird right now. Okay, one of the things I was thinking about doing is... Oh yeah, my daughter Hera... Uh, I'm proud of her. If she becomes just, that's fine. Okay, but... One of the things we were thinking about doing is just killing this guy, but... As things go, I'm pretty sure we won't be able to do that because... The Spy Master doesn't want to anymore. So that means we basically can't do it. And we're not getting any luck when it comes to killing him because apparently it was taking us so long to do anything that there's basically no point. Um, in terms of his other sons, for some reason, it, this family seems to have really everything locked down. I mean, you literally cannot expand in terms of everything. Um, luckily though, I don't think... The good thing about all this is that I don't think our leaves has passed medium crown authority yet. If, she had pa if he had passed me in crown authority, I'd just be like, Well, time to restart, because there's absolute What? You, you, you got a claim? You, 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 you Chancellor Simmons Eskin, oh my gosh, you finally got a claim. Oh, thank you. Thank you, man. Oh, thank you, almighty. I think we're Christian, right? Thank you, almighty God! Oh, finally! A chance to finally expand, and let's see his realm. I don't even care. I can hire mercenaries. We're gonna go beat this guy up. I don't even care. I should actually... Wait, before I do this, who are his allies? Dukes of Saxony. Count, count, count. Well, it doesn't really matter, because I have the king on my side. Booyah! And even if I don't, I don't really care. So, um, we're going to hire a mercenary company, the most cheapest one that's going to cost us the least amount. I mean, it doesn't matter. We do have enough money to last a little bit, but we'll hire the Swiss band. Um, I like them. They're, they're, they're okay. Wait, we'll make sure they're actually like, um, how many troops do they have in total? Because I remember I've done this before where I've hired an entire mercenary company that was literally almost dead and been like, shoot, that's stupid of me. But, let's see. Let's hire these guys right here. Um, they're the cheapest. Well, actually, these guys right here are the cheapest. But, light cavalry are bad, and so are... This one, concurrently, is probably the best. So, we'll hire him. Give it a little bit of time so that the, you know, the troops are a little bit, you know, have morales. And, oh my goodness. Finally, dude, we finally have claims. Oh. I, I mean, this feels so good. It took... It took so long to finally get one decent claim. And, oh my goodness, wow, this, these are all great traits. Wh whichever, patient, kind, or brave, either way. Lucky Star fears no one, so she has gained the brave trait. Lucky Star is honestly a really good child. Like, family relationships wise, Lucky Star is now of legal age, she has become a great eminence. See what I mean? Lucky Star, you are. Well, actually, you kind of base stat-wise bad, but, I mean, diplomacy-wise, you're pretty good. I mean, you were trained by your brother who's, like, awesome at diplomacy. I, I don't want to brag or anything, but I think I'm awesome. And let's see, we're finally ready. Um, I don't even care. Let's see, declare war, conquer this, send. Alright, let's go. It doesn't even matter. I don't, like I said, I really, really at this point of how many times I have been, like... Um, how many instances I've had of just like stupid things happening? I'm just going to accept it and go with it. Okay, you, can I get you to come into my war? Because technically speaking, you are technically, uh, you know, my king. I mean, 
You you are my king, but I do have a who am I alliance to, by the way? Um Technically speaking, I have no solid alliances. I just realized that. Rufus Shedder James though is coming out on my side because he already loves me. Rufus Shedder James, I'm just gonna keep him as that. He's such an awesome character. And they were gonna go smash his army. Hopefully his allies doesn't join in. Yes! And there we go. Smashy smashy smash. And they're all dead. Good job. Um, we can bring up about half the troops to go kill his rest of his army. That way he doesn't have any chances of coming back. And for the first time in... Oh, no, I'm not going to finish that sentence. I finally am able to expand. Oh, my gosh. Goodness gracious. Hey, Chancellor. Chancellor, hey, now let's see if this Chancellor can do it again. Can he give me another claim on another decent piece of land? Let me kill off this guy. Okay. Um, the mayor. Most of these guys aren't really powerful enough to fight me. Um, okay, I could probably go kill him with this army. As long as I move quick enough before his other army arrives. Um, and, by the way, who am I directly fighting? Yes, I'm fighting these two guys right here. The mayor and this guy. Okay. And then, yeah, I should be able to defeat them all. Let me just go kill this guy. Bigger, and as usual, the, the tactics over here aren't really... Okay, Rich is finally ready to marry. Can I get her to... Nah, I can't get him to do that. Well, anyways, Rich is going to survive a little bit longer than most of her brothers because... Yay! Good job, guys. I'm going to go kill this. Kill this death stack. Aww. And in Chaos of Battle, you men have managed to corner Mayor Gorg. He resisted bravery before they slew him. Good riddance. Oh, 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 there we go. I was like, no, don't you guys dare break. Okay. And because since this is a, uh, this is only like a one person, is this like a county or, let's see, it's this guy, the county, he is the county of Lennon. Okay, so it would be the entire count, that means I have to kill his entire army. I don't particularly want to do that, so let's just slaughter his men first. Okay, slaughter, slaughter, slaughter. Yes, we'll kill off everyone. And surprisingly made it to 100% war score. Yes, we were enforced demands. Thank you. Thank goodness, guys. We f <gasps> Yay! We finally did it. Wait, wait. I, wa I want to see my empire. I want to see my little dynasties. Well... Dynasty is why this is all the Carling Dynasty. I can't really do about anything with that yet. I will eventually get into there, but um De Jour Duchies. De Jour, they don't have a De Jour like count button? What? I thought there was a De Jour count button. Well diplomacy wise, these are my two realms. Um I own everything, which makes me so happy. I'm finally big enough to do a couple things. Now that you guys are on my territory, just stand down. I don't think I need you guys anymore. And with two provinces, that finally means I have like... Well, we have to wait. Have to wait for the monthly balance to uh, reset, but I should be making more money. My daughter has practically lived in the kitchens, the little glutton. Uh, please get temperate, please get temperate, please get temperate. Yay! My daughter's turning out awesome too. Okay, yeah, let's see, let's see my... Uh, Let's see my daughter. Uh, yeah, she's the genius. Diligent, cynical, honest, just temperate girl. She's turning pretty honest, although I did realize the honest and uh, cynical basically cancel each other out. So it's like, well, actually, no. No, no, they do cancel each other out. So it's kind of like, well, shoot. Kind of wish I could get rid of her cynical trait because that would make it really nice for us. And now look at that, guys. I'm making a whopping 2.8 ducats a day. And one of my children lacks the guardian. Who is it? Nathan Shredder James. He's also a genius. His parents are from Prince. Oh yeah, it's from this guy. Okay. Um. Let's see. Since he could possibly, he could possibly inherit the realm. I want to make sure I get him. Somebody, not me. That's somebody that's good. Well, actually, could Lucky? You know, Lucky Star would actually be not that bad of a person to train him. So. Yeah, Lucky Star, I want you to educate the child of Nathan, if that would be correct. Nathan? No. No. Get, get my sister. My sister is a way more awesome person. 
yeah, let's just let's just let's just make sure that the lines of good things keep happening in good things because this is pretty awesome. Okay, your vassal levies raised too long. Well, let's give me a second, dude. All right. And anyways, we have new vassals, which means new people to hate us, which is not necessarily good. Um, we also it looks like these two places of bishops. I'm not sure if we could attack the church. So, I'm just going to take a point of interest to not try to do that. Claim province over here and see what we can do. Maybe he'll have luck again. I don't know. He might. I mean, we, we had luck over here and I didn't think we would have luck. But he did. Um, in terms of vassals, I'm pretty sure they like me. I mean, I'm a great guy for the most part. I mean, the bishops seem to be like, yeah, we... I mean, the Pope is, well, except for this guy, he's the new conquered one, but for the most part, these guys seem to like me. And we gotta check my new court management to make sure that all these guys are the top people in their branches. Yes, you guys, you're the top. You're definitely not the top anymore. Sorry, dude. He's not the top. Um, this guy's still the top. This guy's still the top. This guy over here, not the top. Whoa, this guy is really good. Okay, yeah, you get to be court chamberlain. There we go. All you guys are 100 pinging on me. Oh, wow. Yeah, my court is starting to become way better than this individual character could ever be by itself. Now we just need more claims. That's still that's still kind of the problem we need. Okay. Um, renounce from the regents. Now I'm going Oh, you still have me on your council? Really? Dude, how stupid are you? Like, seriously, I would kill- I'm still plotting to kill your- your son! Although, now that I think about it, it's probably not gonna happen, because he not only has- Oh yeah, I killed his- Oh yeah, I killed his son. Because I was like, you know, I'm making sure this guy dies at some point. But I don't think he is gonna die, so I think all my planning is just useless. I mean, even if I, like, scheme? Or, like, peasants- Wait, wait, wait. Oh yeah, you. Train troops in my capital. Um... Let's see, study technology. I don't really want you to do that. Visual rumors, corruption, uh, thugs, vessel discoveries, nobles. Uh, plot, discovery chance, t -t 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 plot, power increase. Let's do this. Build a spy network in Lunenburg. Let's see if that will increase me by a little bit. Mm. Oh, and then we have this event. The church preaches celibacy and my friends try to lure me into the holdings. Oh yeah, we had this event happen with our father too. <laughs> And I was like, yeah, you know what, let's just go with that. And we're gonna go on a grand hunt! Wait, did we, we went on a grand hunt, what, wait, what the heck? I did press the button to go on a grand hunt, did, did the hunt just take my money? Cause that'd make me really mad. Okay, and let's go, let's go do that. That smooth, 20% chance, Oh, if I become temperate, that'd be really nice. Please, 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 please. Ah. Wait, aren't I already temperate though? No, I'm not! Well, if I get temperate, then that would be really nice. Alright, good. And then everyone's gonna... Because I'm hosting a feast, everyone's gonna love me. Um, I will spend lavishly on food. Yeah, just spend. I mean, seriously, dude. Everyone, everyone, some uh, vassalage should be able to like me. I mean, everyone almost does. There's only one guy, and that's that guy right there. That's really kind of like, eh, I don't like this guy. He's kind of weird. But everyone else seems to like me, which is good. Now... Yay! Everyone's opinion of me increased. That's good. Still not repaying the dues. <laughs> okay, and let's just decline that plot for a second. Let's see if we can do it again. Do people want to... Oh, people want him dead. Yes. Okay, everyone. Join in. Everyone. Psst, join in. Everyone. We all want him dead. Get, get in on it. We all want this guy dead. Even I want this guy dead. Oh, oh yes! Come on, guys! Come on! Let's do this! Let's do this! Let's finally kill him! <gasps> a courtier has come in force, inviting all knights of the realm to attend a great tournament. Or uh, a chance to prove our worth! Sure, with my... How much martial ability? Nine! I succeeded with the kill... Oh, yes! A track absolute... Oh, yes! Finally, that guy died! Oh my goodness, and Duke Otto of Saxony became incapable! Oh gosh, that is hilarious! <laughs> okay, so now that he's incapable, we now have to start killing off him. The next son in line has to die. Let's see. I mean, he wasn't as great of a 
of a bad person as his brother was, because that made people want him dead. Still, though, I'm surprised we even got his brother. Let's see, we would need 25%. Can I get 25%? If I really pushed it, we could probably get 25% out of all of these people. Um, let's see, how much gold would you want? 33 is not that bad. Okay, let's get him. Let's get... Uh, we, we haven't invited this person. Let's get this person. There we go. And how much plot power do we have now? We'll make sure we have 100. The poor of the realm have suffered terribly under the rule of Duke Otto. As his regent, I'm in a position to give, to give something back to the people. Oh, wait a minute! He made me his regent?! Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh! Shook, he made me his regent! Uh... So, basically... Oh, shoot, so I have the... I basically have the power of the Duke right now. So, the poor of the realm have suffered terribly under the rule of Duke Otto and his regent. I am in a position to give something back to the people. Yes, let's do that. Let's just, if, if it's not my money, let's go spend his money. <laughs> Since Duke Otto is, I don't think he's going to be, uh, you know, speaking to me too much for a little bit. I mean, surprisingly though, he's still really good at martial. Like, he's still better than me at, at swordsmanship, even though the tournament is... Oh, and, oh, the tournament ended? I, I was doing a tournament too? Huh. I'm planning on killing this guy over here. Oh, shoot, we're at war with someone. Who we at war with? Alright, is anyone big? Oh no, it's just a petty little kingdom over there. It's not anything I have to really worry about. A weak claim can claim Thuringia. Okay. We claim this is for your daughter, Hera. Hmm. My daughter, Hera. I could give my daughter the title. I would just have to... Okay, okay, I know how this works, I know how this works. If I wanted to do this, or claim this weak kingdom, uh, is this like the duchy? This is like the duchy, yes. Okay, if I wanted to do this, what I'd have to do is i have to first land her. Okay, and I don't, and I don't want to do that from the church, so the only, okay, um, yeah, but I can't do that, well, let's see, how much time do I have, because I'm pretty sure it's about until... Well, I guess, I guess maybe the claim's all the way... Maybe she could just have it forever, because that'd be awesome. But, let's see. Well, we have to kill this guy first, and then we can start worrying about other stuff. I mean, once this guy is dead, then we can start worrying about, like, all that other stuff. But I have to kill this guy, and then we can start talking about, like, the possibilities of more cooler stuff happening. Wait, is, and is this guy the best? Yeah, you know what? I'm going to keep this diplomat. This guy is good. And then, he's the best marshal we have... This is so awesome. I have a good council now, and I'm really loving it. And let's see. We also have really good stuff happening when it comes to those troublesome peasants. Eh, they can do whatever they want. I'm making like 4.16 ducats a month. What up, we specs? <laughs> Just like, we specs. Okay, the Duchy of Thuringia. Now, why is my why can't my daughter claim it? I I'm kind of wondering how that worked out because, well, actually, now thinking about it, she is technically ruler unmarried. Oh yeah. Well, give me a second. I'm gonna fix that. Okay. Um. Hey, rearrange the betrothal. Uh, arrange marriage between you and me. Oh wait, what? Okay, wait, what? Let's Let's go right here. Yeah, no. I'm patrolled to this woman right here, who is terrible, but it could possibly get me a duchy. So, that's the only reason why I'm accepting this. Okay. And, actually, it's not me. Just, you know, no, 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 no. Wait, what? Uh, for me, a relative duke. I have no clue what the heck I am doing, but let's just like cancel. I, I have no clue. Like, can, can we stop? Like, I don't know what's happening here, but succession nomination. It seems like Baron Rufford James is wanting to be the second one in power. You know, honestly, 
Wilfred, you are the second person I would trust to my life. Okay? And I should probably figure out how to get this betrothal done. Unless... Cause she's cause she's old enough now, isn't she? Yeah, she's old enough. Um, let's arrange the marriage. No? Okay, hey, hey. We, we had a betrothal. Arrange betrothal, arrange marriage between... Uh, me? The, the lovely count over here? Okay. Well, it seems like I'm figuring this out next time, people. Well, thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.